Hi everybody and welcome to part one of a tutorial on how to install the Digitronic Multipoint Injection System. I'm going right now to the a website of Digitronic, it's digitronicgas.com and you slide over the resource center and you have to click to get on the technical support. Here we have some manuals, um, homologations, but uh, down below we have also the software. Ah yes, uh, a new important message about the new software version. If you are using Digitronic software already, an uh, old version, it's uh, you have to, it, in order to make it uh, run flawlessly, you have to uninstall the old one, install the new one, upload the new firmware to the ACU and reset the ACU. The third and fourth step we will do in the second part of this tutorial uh, where we're gonna set up a Digitronic MP48 OBD ACU in uh, actual car. But let's do this later. I'm going to download the software first. So this is the Digitronic Multipoint software that we need for this one. So I'm going to download it and put it on my desktop. Let's do this right now and wait. Um, we download the soft, however it is a zip file, so please note you have to unzip it somehow. I'm doing it uh, right now with just pulling out the folder on my desktop. desktop. Okay, here we go. I'm going to open the folder that can close the old one and here we already have the setup exe. I'm going to start that. No more need for this one. So um, here we go. One, uh, one little word about this. If you are the only user on this uh, laptop or you have uh, or every user has complete access to everybody else's users so that's no problem to install it like this but in case there are more users on a uh, laptop um, better to select this option just in, in order to make sure the firmware files and the documents and so on will land in your directory and you can access them. So um, we install it like this. The installation should be pretty quick. And we are set and done. We finish it and I'm going to start the um, software. And here we go. The first two windows that appears are because of I have no no connection to any ACU so far, but I wanted to enter it like this to just to show you a few things uh, before we start a connection. First, and uh, um, about version, you can see the latest version of it. So here you go and see if you have the right uh, software version and also ACU programming. Here you can find all the latest uh, firmware. So um, here we have, for example, MP48, the latest one, and MP48 OBD, the latest for MP32. And if you have six eight cylinders, you have to go over there. And for six eight cylinder ACU uh, and for MP6C. So these are the uh, firmwares that you should have installed over here. And the SAD. Thanks a lot and see you soon.